Denise Welch has reignited her years-long feud with Piers Morgan following his previous comments about Meghan Markle and the royal family. The Loose Women presenter addressed the Duke and Duchess of Sussex Netflix series, Harry and Meghan, where the royal suggested Prince William's communications office leaked or traded stories with the British press. Taking to Twitter, Denise, 64, shared a screenshot of an article that read, Piers Morgan claims royal family have reached out to thank him for attacks on Meghan. In view of her 550,000 followers, the Loose Women panelist bent, also if this is indeed true, and he says he never lies, it proves Harry is 100, percent, right. Social media users flocked to comment on the tweet as they offered their support to the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. Commentator Dominique Samuels bent, wow that's so bad. Twitter user Lisa tweeted, after watching Harry's interview and the Netflix documentary. I have the utmost respect for Harry and Meghan. Jas penned, this is shocking. Denise referenced an article from April 2021 published in the immediate aftermath of his exit from Good Morning Britain where Piers, 58, said he had received messages on behalf of members of the royal family expressing their gratitude after Meghan and Harry's tell-all Oprah chat the same year. At the time, he shied away from name-dropping which member of the royal family had sent their well wishes to the star. The broadcaster dropped the bombshell in an interview with extras Billy Bush. I've had some messages communicated to me on behalf of several members of the royal family, he said at the time. Piers added the members of the royal family were delighted someone was standing up for them. He added, I'm not going to go into who it was. But gratitude that somebody was standing up. Express.co.uk has contacted Piers Morgan's representatives for comment. Gordon Ramsay accidentally drops baby news in non-air quip latest Jeremy Clarkson returns to social media after Meghan Markle fiasco Royals Linda Robson warns him coming for them in swipe at co-star's admission, his comments came after his dramatic exit from GMB when he said he didn't believe a word Meghan said during her tell-all chat with Oprah. Piers is yet to address Denise's tweet having blocked the Loose Women star on his social media account. Meanwhile, Harry addressed press intrusion in the couple's Netflix docuseries. In episode 4 the Duke suggested is a long-running practice between the offices representing royal family members and the press to trade stories. I have 30 years experience of looking behind the curtain and seeing how the system works and how it runs, Harry said. I mean, just constant briefings about other members of the family, about favors inviting the press in. It's a dirty game. He went on, you know, there's leaking, but there's also planting of stories. So if the comms teams want to be able to remove a negative story about their principal, they will trade and give you something about someone else's principal. So the offices end up working against each other. It's a kind of this weird understanding or acceptance that happens. Buckingham Palace have not released a statement on any of Harry's allegations, 